Hi guys, in this video we're going to go through what to do when you have a pool of water underneath your water heater. The first step to take is to put the gas control into the off position. If the water is spraying or pouring out, it is best to shut off the water supply to the water heater. If it is a slow leak, leave the water on to help determine where it is leaking from. Then once determined, shut the valve off until the leak is repaired. It's always best to start at the top, checking the hot and cold risers, fittings and tank nipples, all of which are repairable. If the previous spots are all dry and there's water leaking from the top seam, a replacement tank will most likely be required. A very common leaking source is from the temperature and pressure relief valve. Be sure to check the threaded connection into the tank as well as the end of the drip tube. Inspect the gas control valve where it enters the tank for any water. Another very common leaking source is the drain valve. If it is coming out of the drain spout, it may just require being snugged up. Check the threaded connection into the tank as well. If all of these checks come out dry, check the bottom seam. Leaking from this area almost always requires a replacement water heater. Well guys, thanks for watching my video. And like always, if this video helped you out, liking, commenting, subscribing is always greatly appreciated. Till next time. Hey guys, this is a super condensed video on possible areas where a water heater can leak. Once you've determined the source of the leak, please visit our water heater video playlist where you can find helpful tutorials on repairs, replacements, and troubleshooting.